Okay, so when you first get here to Columbia, it's very important you get your cellular service going. You won't have any data. So if you're like T-Mobile or something, unless you have Google Fi Network, which is I highly recommend, it's an international, it, it, it changes to the strongest network in almost every country. But if you don't have Google Fi, the next thing you're gonna have to do when you land is you're gonna have to go to Claro, and you're gonna have to do two things. You're gonna have to get a SIM card and you're gonna have to actually have them register the phone with Columbia. The way that, because they register the phones with Columbia, it stops from people selling stolen phones. So if they, if they lock your phone out, it's gonna be a big pain in the butt in which you're gonna have to go down to Central and get it unlocked and show proof of ownership. So it's very, very, very important when you land that when you get your SIM card here at Claro, I'm here at Santa Fe, yeah, you tell them to register their phone with Columbia. Okay, let's go do it, Mom. So more news about getting your phone hooked up here in Claro. So if you have a Boost phone from the United States or you've got a, a PCS Metro phone, does not work in Colombia, most likely. They do not work. So we're just gonna buy a phone. It's about the cheapest phone they have is 402 mil, which is about 130 bucks. I'm not gonna worry about it. We gotta get because she has to have service. My mom has to have internet service. Have a phone, especially it's a double win. So if anybody robs her for it, it's only a hundred ver hundred bucks versus you know five or six hundred dollars for her phone now. So and then when she comes back to Colombia. You know, she can just, you know, we know it's going to work. We're not going to have this problem. We'll keep the prepaid SIM card in there. That's another thing. A prepaid SIM card, yeah, they have it for two gigs that last 15 days for like 20 mil. And then they have 4.5 gigs of data uh, for like 42 mil, which is like 15 bucks for the month. 10 gigs is pretty good.